Recently, there has been an increasing rate of leverage of user personal data and media experiences from advertisements to personalization of social media feeds to content tailoring within cutting-edge media research like interactive media and adaptive media. But what we see here are a number of wider social technical challenges that confront the shift towards personal data use. So what are these challenges? They are concerns around privacy, transparency and control, accountability and trust. As you can see here, many of these challenges and particularly responses to them hail from varied disciplines. Hence, there remains a gap in research around holistic responses to these challenges in relation to emergent data-driven media experiences. Hence, we turn our focus to our user-oriented response framework, human data interaction, or HDI, which takes into account the multidisciplinary nature of these discussed challenges and proposes holistic responses to them through three core principles. Legibility is the process of making data interactions, associated inferences, and implications comprehensible. Negotiability for data-driven technologies is the possibility of users making data negotiations around their personal data leverage. Agency is the notion of enabling users with the ability to exercise informed control on their personal data. In this work, we present the inclusion of these principles of HDI within the design of a prototype of a new media service proposition that demands substantial amounts of user personal data. In your everyday life, you might have a Netflix account, maybe Amazon Prime, Spotify, BBC, so we propose bringing together these siloed media data to power a cross-media profiler where you just connect your favorite music, podcast, and video apps and it reveals tailored suggestions that takes into account everything you love watching and listening to. This is a whole lot more data and so we believe the call to be sensitive to the underlying data processing to be even more amplified here. Hence, we provide a personal data store or a PDS, a secure place to store your data. The PDS would come in between the data and the organization and it would manage all data and its processing client side. Thus, the CMP is a media content discovery service built on a personal data store that allows the user to link their media profiles and associated data from different digital media platforms. So how did we design legibility, negotiability, and agency into this prototype? For legibility, we ensured that the language used during the sign-up process was simple. Information about the data practices were distributed over different stages, and a permissions page was designed to communicate key points about the service. Data negotiability was built into the very core of the CMP through the notion of data linking, where users are given the choice to import their data from different media platforms. Agency is enabled through the personal data store. Here, users have the ability to review and make edits to their data through a media profile interface. A lightweight onboarding website flow introducing the key concepts discussed here was created as a research probe, which was used to enable five online focus groups. The service was predominantly well received by the participants. The value of the service was largely attributed to the PDS with 21 out of 23 participants. Happy to sign up for the service if the PDS was a part of it, but the participants also expressed their reservations about the level of understanding and the control mechanisms here, which we present as two sets of contributions. The first, a set of practical design reasonings that speak to the gap in media literature around data-sensitive responses to the challenges discussed. Our findings highlight the significance of the need for clear communication of the rationale behind the adoption of data-sensitive measures. The challenges it alleviates are detailed around how this alleviation happens on a practical level and its limitations. It also suggests that one of the responses to this challenge is provision of increased detail and granularity around the data and the data flows. Also, data-oriented responses should be contextualized within the experience so that these processes are less data-heavy and more relatable to the audiences. We propose for more options to support active control at varying levels from granular control to managing data associated with different users, shared profiles, and multiple accounts. Also of significance is the need for the users to see the effect of the data within the experience. Finally, we highlight the need for an effective summary of the data, data flows, and processes contextualized within the service and also to lift the constraints on temporal limitations of pressuring the users to make a decision at the moment. We also present a critique of the principles of HDI, particularly when applied in data-driven media experiences. Firstly, legibility goes beyond data, extending to the results of data processing and the benefits and implications. Secondly, to explicitly highlight the data-sensitive measures undertaken. Thirdly, to contextualize these measures within the scope of the service for negotiability. Firstly, to be considerate of complex scenarios like multiple accounts, shared accounts, and multiple profiles. Secondly, the facility for the user to be able to choose to move data between themselves, providers, or both. For agency, firstly, to accommodate for a varied spectrum of user interests in terms of control, and agency should be better enabled at the consent stage through the user's precise summaries and the capacity to make changes before any consent is derived. Thank you.